surprisingly, the country with the highest percentage of girls on skateboards is Afghanistan. And responsible for this development is Oliver. He is the founder of Skatistan. Uh, Oliver, what is Skatistan? Skatistan is a non-governmental organization that uses skateboarding to connect vulnerable children to educational opportunities. So, and why skateboarding? Skateboarding is something that is a lot of fun and skateboarding was something that kids in Kabul were really excited about. So, when I had my skateboard there, they tried to like rip it away from me and, and use it and I thought, this is something that the kids want. There's so many people trying to uh, bring new ideas to Afghanistan about what they might want, but uh, this is something that they actually want. So I pursued it. Yeah, and how did you link skateboarding to education? It was it was simply something that was needed. The kids need education to be able to build their build their country, and only Afghans can change Afghanistan. And so. The, we linked skateboarding to education by doing one hour of skateboarding and one hour in the in the classes. And um, this is this is something that education is something that the kids are ex just as excited about as skateboarding. And they actually become really good as well, right? Some some of the kids they they definitely got better than better than me at skateboarding within a, a quite a short amount of time. I've been skateboarding for almost thirty four years now. And uh, some of the young kids are way better than I am. Pro skaters, maybe? Sometime in the future, perhaps. So, and in Afghanistan, 40% of the skaters are female. Uh, why is this? This is something that we prioritized. We prioritized um, girls to, to be part of the, the program because it's very hard for them to do other sports. Other sports like soccer and volleyball are just seen as activities for boys because other people see boys doing it. And because skateboarding was so brand new, we had this loophole. Nobody had, could say that this is just a boys sport. And it started to become to be seen as a sport for girls in Afghanistan. Thank you so much, Oliver. And for you guys at home, visit their webpage. Bye bye.